Hello, I'm Hanai from Tokyo Top 5 Percent of Restaurant Guide. I'm so happy to be in Japanese because we can eat best unagi in the world. A hundred percent of travelers who eat Japanese domestic unagi say s they want to eat again. Today, we're going to tell you about very popular Japanese soul food, unagi. We got three topics about it history of unagi, find best place to eat unagi, how to eat unagi. History of Unagi. On the day called Doyo no Shinohi, in English, the midsummer day of the ox, Japanese people have traditionally eaten eel. Most oldest Japanese poetry book says, Eat eel to help keep cool during the summer. Our eating habit doesn't change the old days even now. 5,000 years ago, Ale's born was found from the ruin. There are more than 35,000 of river and mountains covers almost 70% of country in Japan. Of course, freshwater fish are familiar for us. 700. I mentioned it before, the ill was on the poetry book. 1300. The ill started called kabayaki because the shape and color were similar to this plant. In the past, people ate unagi with this style. 1700. In the Edo period, restaurants appeared for the first time in the public. Even among those, ill was popular as luxury food for Edo's common people. Do you know there is a big difference between eastern and western part of Japan? Two parts of Japan was fighting each other, so they established their own culture. A trace of this custom remains today. Talk about ill. In Tokyo, it's steamed and grilled, but in Osaka, it's just grilled. Edo style has fantastic extra effort. To tell the truth, definitely eat ill in Tokyo. To steam unagi, it gets more soft and healthy. By the way, as Nagoya, Osaka style eaten with Japanese dashi. At Fukuoka, ill steamed with rice called Seiro Mushi. By the way, a nago, salt water eel, is smaller than eel, which live in the ocean. It's less fat and tastes plain than eel. Very popular for tempura and nigiri sushi. Find best place to eat unagi. So, go to specialty store. Now, we are in Shinjuku and this is specialized store for unagi place. You better not go into eat unagi for family restaurant or chain izakaya. No, don't go. Today at Shinjuku, we are at Nobori Tei. Oh, there is a menu. Unagi, Japanese unagi. Ooh. And menus, and they got matsu, take, ume, and it's the recommend, they recommend the take in the middle of the price. If you see unaju around 1,000 yen, it's from China. Compared to Chinese eel, it has thick and bigger, also hard and oily. This is not eel what we want you to eat. Alright, we got unaju and unadon. And also, shiroyaki. What is the 
the differences between Unaju and Unadon? It's kind of obvious, right? I got uh, one unagi, and for Unadon, it's with half of unagi. And also, this is kabayaki taste. It tastes like soy and kind of sweet taste. And we got the uh, shiroyaki. It tastes with salt. You can put the wasabi on it. Ready to taste fast unagi in the world? Let's eat! A hundred percent of travelers who ate Japanese domestic unagi says they want to eat again. Today, we're going to tell you about very popular Japanese soul food, unagi. We got three topics about it. History of unagi. Find best place to eat unagi. How to eat unagi. Stay with us till the end. On the day called Doyo no Shinohi in English, the midsummer day of Ox. Oh, uh, Ox? 